Paracelsus, the alchemist of ancient Pyjay Empire, created flight stones to make flying islands. Later, airship knights were created using that same power. Soon, the flight stones meant power itself, and the Moer Empire attacked flying islands to get more flight stones. The expelled flying island tribes had to settle in Border Town, the center of the continent. Many years later, when the Border Town residents were adapting to life on the ground, The Dark Mage Dante cracked the seal of the evil world. The town was brutally attacked by evil creatures. Fire was all you could smell, and grief was all you could hear. Carving all the pain deeply into your heart, you swore to yourself, I will find it at all costs. The highest flying island that no one can reach. Wow, my introduction skills are just perfect! Hmm, so what do you think? Are you starting to remember? Dang, the soul is badly tangled. Look in your right pocket. There will be your ID card. Can't you see? You were an airship captain. I need to get all my memories back. I feel like I need to remember everything. <sighs> okay, let me take a closer look at your soul. Even if your head hurts, be patient. That's great. You... You are eliminated. Now go home! You said I was great! Why am I eliminated? You need to ask. Even if you were from Tessa, it wouldn't be easy to pass. But you're from Border Town? That's even worse. How will we know whether a flying island will harbor allegiance to His Majesty, our Emperor, or vengeance? But. Next!
The knights with the best skills will be appointed by His Majesty as the Imperial Airship Knights. <laughs> with so many young people gathering to become knights of our empire, the future of Moer is bright. It's... it's the Resistance! Everyone protect me in His Majesty! Christine! Come on, stop those bastards! If you block that dual sword, the Emperor will be trapped like a rat! Squad A, surround the dual sword as planned. How have you been, Your Majesty? You dirty rat. You, you, you rude! If you don't back down right away, I will! We have had enough of you now. In the name of Eden! A Angel! Who did? I'll remember your face. Everyone, retreat! Oh, oh, oh! You saved my life! You are the kind of person Moer was looking for. These are some wise words. A person like that deserves to be on Moer's airship. Yes, you are right. Oh, Your Majesty, this is someone from Border Town. What? Harlow, you bastard! Why are you saying that now? Are you crazy? Why did you tell the Flying Islander to become an airship knight? Thwack! That's because Your Majesty first called him the latest Moer's talent! Forget it! Hurry up and take back what you said. Ah, but if you ignore what you've already announced in front of a lot of people, you'll lose face. <laughs> I'll honor what you did today by giving you the position of airship captain. <laughs> However, to do so, you must show that you are qualified to be captain. First, take this airship and defeat Drake's Sky Pilots in Oru. If you succeed in this mission, then I will appoint you as the official airship captain. Yes, sir. <laughs> It's good to see your ambitious attitude. You still need to have a set. Christine! Take over as our new captain's aide. I... me? Yes, yes. You're from Tessa. So you should know better than anyone how a newcomer to more air must feel. Yes, Your Majesty.
Hey, I heard you're from Tessa. Nice to meet you. Shut up. I am a knight of the Moer Empire. If you argue about my origins, you won't be safe, even if you're a captain. Trust me. Sorry. I know I have a lot to learn, so please help me. <laughs> Do you really think the Emperor will recognize you as a captain? Don't delude yourself. You are just a nice toy for him to play with. I do not care. I still got a chance, and I won't pass it up. We'll see how long that determination will last. What? What's happening? Down, Engine! Down these chunks of scrap! Still, I'm glad we've arrived safely in Oral. Does it really look like we've arrived safely? Whoa! Now this is ours! Ah! Bad guys! Stop where you are! Are you okay? Oh. Oh, Those guys stole my engine! It was a precious thing that I made with Mom! Don't worry. I'll find it for you. Really? Of course! break into the realm of the Drake Sky Pirates! Are you members of Drake's group? <laughs> yes! We're not just regular Sky Pirates! I don't care about Druk, Drake, or whatever! Give me the engine! What? We'll make you regret ignoring our boss! your mother. Ah, uh, that. I... I thought about it while you were gone. The reason why my mom and I were able to be happy while making this engine was... Because we imagined an airship that would one day fly freely in the sky, and that we would go on an adventure. I want to give our engine a great adventure! You speak of the engine like it's alive? <laughs> but I have one condition. Let me join in on the adventure! I want to go on an adventure with my engine! As you wish. After all, it would be convenient if a technician joined us. Welcome, Alby.
trouble now. Shouldn't you be punished for harassing my team? They bothered us first. That's right. You guys stole Albie's engine! So, it gives you the right to harass my team and steal the engine? <sighs> it hurts so much! I... Uh, I know. Hitting and stealing is a bad thing. Yes, but... You idiot. Anyone can see that this is nonsense. If it's not yours in the first place, why did we end up stealing it? Hmm, because the items that once fell into our hands now belong to us. I'm speechless. Trying to talk to you is useless. <laughs> Same for us. Reflect once you reach the afterlife. Ah, hmm. uh, hello. No, a little deeper. Hello, Celine. What do you want? Oh, just keep it short. How have you been? To commemorate the day you joined us, we prepared an incredible gift. I said I didn't need such an anniversary. No, it's a historic day when me, myself, and I won the great climate made Celine. <laughs> so why don't you come here now? Huh, where is it? <laughs> this is the arena, Celine! Hi, she's coming soon! Blow one million balloons until the boss arrives! <laughs> I can't even. Let's have fun next time. Dana, go to the arena.